Hi there, Kickstarters. Uh, I want to talk to you about a project that we've been working on. It's called There Aren't Monsters Under Your Bed, a storybook for non-believers. The reason we created this was because, uh, like many of you, I grew up on fantasies and fables and fairy tales and the Bible. And there's very little out there that teaches us how to think for ourselves, especially kids. Even now when I'm looking for gifts for my nieces or nephews or godchildren, the stuff that is out there is very boring. So we created this storybook. It's got great illustrations, it rhymes, it's a lot of fun, and it's just about teaching kids how to think for themselves. There Aren't Monsters Under Your Bed, a storybook for non-believers, is about a little girl named Connie who thinks there are monsters under her bed. And her mom looks under her bed and says they're not there. She checks her closet, they're not there. But her brother, Izzy Dean, ID, refuses to believe. He keeps saying, maybe they're hiding, maybe they're in the wall, maybe they're in the ceiling. And eventually the mother calls a monster patrol, who checks, and they say there aren't any monsters here. And Izzy refuses to believe, and they get their magic Zamboni and take him through time and space and the past and the present, and still, he will not accept the fact that there really aren't monsters because there's no evidence of them. And the little girl, Connie, learns how to think for herself. And she knows that if somebody tells her to be afraid of something she can't see or if somebody's God makes her wake at the knees, she says with a smirk, prove it to me. Uh, it's a lot of really cool stuff for kids. They seem to love it. We've got some great incentives for you if you look online if you can just want to lend a little support or if you want to get the first copy of the book or even more uh, we hope we've given you some neat incentives we're just looking for some help to get it printed and published and hopefully get one of the first copies in your hand so thank you for your support you can see some of the illustrations in the kickstarter write-up or in the video and if you can give us a hand uh, we would love it thank you and if you have any questions feel free to ask